Welcome to today's DDRX. Our anchoring scripture is Genesis 2, 7. And the Lord God formed man of the dust of the ground and breathed into his nostrils the breath of life. And man became a living being. Today we want to decree life, wholeness, vitality, you know, strength. So you want to say, I'm old, I'm alive, I'm living, I am strong. The Bible tells us in Isaiah 40, 31, but those who wait on the Lord shall renew their strength. They shall mount up with wings like eagles. They shall run and not be weary. They shall walk and not faint. So I want you to decree that I'm not going to burn out. I'm not going to be sick. Philippians 4.13 says, I can do all things through Christ that strengthens me. You know, there was a narrative in the book of John chapter 11. When one of Jesus' friends died, Lazarus, and Mary and Martha sent for Jesus. In John 11, 38 to 44, then Jesus, again groaning in himself, came to the tomb. It was a cave, and a stone lay against it. Jesus said, take away the stone. Martha, the sister of him who was there, said to him, Lord, by this time there is a stench, for he has been dead four days. Jesus said to her, Did I not say to you that if you believe, you will see the glory of God? Then they took away the stone from the place where the dead man was lying. And Jesus lifted up his eyes and said, Father, I thank you that you hear me, that you have heard me. And I know that you always hear me. But because of the people who are standing by, I said this, that they may believe that you sent me. Now when he had said these things, he cried with a loud voice, Lazarus, come forth. And he who had died came out bound, and and foot with grave clothes, and his face was wrapped with a cloth. Jesus said to him, loose him and let him go. I want us to decree together, I'm coming out, I decree I'm coming out of every captivity. I decree every deadness will be turned around to life. I decree an end to sorrow, sign, and sickness. I decree powers assigned to turn my glory to shame, scattered by fire in Jesus' name. I decree my life is preserved. I decree life will not be rough for me. I decree my life and my roads shall be smooth. I decree I will dwell in the secret place of the Most High. I shall abide under the shadow of the Almighty. I decree God is my refuge and my fortress. I decree that God would deliver me from the snare of the fowler and from the perilous pestilence. I decree God will cover me with his feathers and under his wings I shall take refuge. I decree I will not be afraid of coronavirus. I will not be afraid of the terror by night, nor of the arrow that flies by day not the pestilence that walks in darkness, not the destruction that lay waste at no day. In Jesus' name, thank you.